Hi, my sweets. Welcome to today's lesson where we're gonna learn how to glitter a mug. Um, also, um, let's go over um, the materials to make sure that you are ready to go for the lesson. Okay, of course, you need to have your mug. Any mug will do, you know, whatever's your preference. Then um, you're gonna need the glitter. Um, I buy this brand. I went with brown because I am uh, working on the mug uh, for fall, Halloween. So I went well with brown. Um, this one you can find it at Walmart um, or you can actually order it from Amazon. Um, this one is extra, ex extra fine, I'm so sorry, extra fine espresso. Um, I have another lesson where I explain every um, type of glitter. You know, you have extra fine, you have fine, you have chunky. Um, so go ahead and take a look at that lesson so that way you get familiar with the different type of glitters. Also, um, you should have the craft paint uh, in brown uh, because the first application, we're gonna go ahead and do it with paint and then we're gonna apply the glitter to the paint. Um, we're doing this because that way when the glitter falls, um, you will be using less glitter, you know, cause the brown with the brown helps, you know, you know, you're going to have the glitter, but it's going to use less glitter and then you'll be able to, um, you know, if you have any like spots that really didn't get that much glitter, it just it will blend in. Although we will be doing a second coat because you always have to do a second coat so that way everything is even and you have a better prettier application as well we're gonna go ahead and use a makeup brush okay i got this one at the dollar tree and my local dollar tree here in florida um but you can use any type of of makeup brush you know um as long as it is a makeup brush um we don't use um the the paintbrush because the paintbrush tends to leave streaks so when you're applying the paint, it doesn't um, leave it smooth. So then it makes streaks on it. And when you apply the glitter, it just does not look very well. Before you start the lesson, another thing that you're gonna need and make sure that you have it um, is either this, which is part of a pool noodle and I went ahead and cut it up and I grabbed the one that, that would have the size that would fit in here. Or you can go ahead and purchase this from Amazon. It, it comes in different sizes. Um, you can go ahead and go look at another lesson where I explain the different ones that you can use um, for mugs, tumblers, and whatnot. And then this, so that way you can hold it and apply the glitter without getting your hands dirty and not touching it because then you don't want for it to get uh, messed up when you know after you finish applying the glitter. So it's very important that you have as well this um, material. As well, the second application will not be with paint. The second application of the glitter will be with glue. So you need to have the glue as well. And lastly, and importantly, you will need to have paper. Paper that you're gonna fold in half. So when you are we're applying the glitter, it has somewhere to fall into. So that way, once you're done, you can use it to go ahead and put it into the, the bottle. So that way you don't lose any glitter and you just put it straight into the bottle. And by folding it, you create like a little crevice that it just, the glitter just, you know, goes all the way down. Okay. And of course, wear some protective um, apron or if you don't have any just go ahead and wear clothes that you wouldn't want them to get damaged or ruined you know um, i'm wearing you know my everyday clothes so if you have a nice shirt on or anything like that just go ahead and change out to something you know more that you're not gonna feel bad um it you know getting ruined but let's go ahead and start glittering our mug i'm so excited so let's go ahead and do that I already squirted my uh, paint and I am applying it or smoothing it out with my makeup brush. 
We have to do um, smooth strokes. Here, um, it's going to be a little bit different instead of what I was doing in the rest of the mug because we need to get in the inside of the handle. This one here. Just turn it around so you can get every single spot. And now that I have applied my paint, I'm gonna go ahead and glitter. You're gonna start start from the top, okay? and start glittering. And you're gonna do a motion like if you're, um, you know, going up and down or side to side or back and forth. And you're gonna go and grab it and apply it in every single little spot. When we get to the bottom, we go ahead and just go ahead and like if you're sprinkling something because that one is going to be a little bit harder to to do but if you see we went ahead and glittered everything it seems like it it, it covered everything but we're still going to go ahead and do a second layer now that we applied the first layer of the glitter come back for part two of the lesson that way we can go ahead and finish up that beautiful fall mug.